Hi students, my name is Pramod Kumar. I am taking English class to second standard students. Last class we have discussed about adjectives part 1. In that class we have discussed order of adjectives. Right? But in this class I am going to take adjectives part 2. Position of adjectives. Yeah? Any sentence you take if there is an adjective means, you can easily identify where is the position of that adjective. Okay. Uh, this part we will learn in this lesson. Okay. Uh, for example, read carefully, pay attention to the words in blue. Hi, I am Rob, the green monster. Look at my arms and fingers. They are green and sticky. You can easily identify adjectives in this sentence as already revealed in blue color. They are green and sticky. Understood now? Here they are using these adjectives after the verb. I have three large eyes. They help me see insects that are tiny. We are talking about insects. We are describing that insects. Insects are tiny. Okay, and then I have two red horns. I guess I look smart with them. I guess I look smart with them. No one smart also an adjective. We are using this smart after the word. Then look at my soft shoes. My shirt is very long and has a cape. My blue trousers are nice. Look at my fingernails. I always keep them clean. I hope you understood that you, you can easily identify the adjectives in any sentence. So, okay. So, that's the next part. This one is very important. Here the two rules are there. That the first one is adjectives are usually placed before nouns. Yeah. First part is we are using adjectives before nouns. See, this is the first part. For example, I have a green sharpener. A green sharpener. In this sentence, where is the adjective? Adjective is green. Green is an adjective. I am going to describe a sharpener. Sharpener is a noun. Sharpener is a noun. I use the adjective before the noun. Before the noun. This one is a noun. I am using this adjective here. So, this one is noun. I am using here before the noun. This rule applied here. Before the noun. Understood now? So, that the second rule says, some adjectives can be placed after verbs. This one also very important. And second one is after the verbs. You can see the sentence here. My sharpener sentences. First sentence, I have a green sharpener. Second sentence, my sharpener is green. These both sentences are meaning, same meaning. It gives same meaning. But one thing you can understand here, that the first sentence I am using adjectives, same adjective, but I use it before now. And second sentence also I am using same adjective green only, but I am using here after the word. After the word. See, these are the difference between these two sentences. First part we are using adjectives, 
before now second we are using some adjectives after the verb understood now in this activity underline the adjectives used after the verbs first thing you should identify the adjectives then you have to see is this adjective used after the verb or before a noun you should understand this thing only yeah okay which one is which ad adjective is we used after the verb that adjective you should underline that the first one is ruben's shirt is brown in this sentence brown is an adjective here we use brown after the verb so this one is the right answer second the gate is blue the gate is blue here also we use adjective this one is the adjective we use it after the verb only after the verb only so this one also right answer third one the book case is huge here also we use is is a verb after the verb we are using this huge so this one also right answer underline the huge fourth the earthworm is slow earthworm is slow we are using fourth one the earthworm is slow in this sentence also we are using slow is an adjective we are using slow after the verb is fifth janaki's hair is long and silky long and silky both are adjectives but we are using after the verb is the cupcake is hot we are using is is a verb after the is we are using hot hot is an adjective so you can underline hot my uncle's house is is beautiful here also in this sentence we are using beautiful is an adjective but we use beautiful after the verb only you can underline beautiful polar bears are cute are is a verb cute is an adjective so after the verb only we use this cute you can underline it the playground is large large is an adjective we use it after the verb lemon is sour yes right it is sour is an adjective we use it after the verb only the cloth is rough the cloth is rough rough is an adjective we use it after the verb the knife is sharp sharp is an adjective we use it after the verb is sharp you can underline suman's book is brown right brown is an adjective good but we are using after the verb only so that question is underline the adjectives used after the verb so these are all sentences you take they use the adjectives after the verb only understood now it's okay next b complete the sentences with adjectives from the list in the box once you read here old small hot long blue yeah small already has been done here one question already over second granny is dash granny is it should be old granny is old ravi's shirt is blue riya's dress is long this copy is hot this copy is hot this you can write here first one small old second one old third one blue fourth long fifth hot fifth one is hot and 
next one let us listen listen carefully and keep the adjectives first i will read the passage it is in your last page in your textbook last page see page number 97 i'll read first the big parcel arrived the excited children rushed to the blue door they greeted the tall courier boy and were thankful to him they were curious about the gifts they opened the blue cardboard box quickly and found there were five small piggy banks there was a short note to inside it said pinky's piggy bank is blue rashi's piggy bank is green jen's piggy bank is orange rehan will get the yellow piggy bank and the red piggy bank is for little simi yeah now you can do these activities the small or big parcel arrived you should write now which one is the right answer here the big parcel arrived actually in the in, uh, passage so the first one is the big is the right answer second there's no first and second so you can write the first big the dash happy and excited children actually it should be excited only the excited children second third rush to the blue or wooden door which one is the right answer actually blue is the right answer next they greeted the short or tall courier boy actually the courier boy was tall only right the tall is the right answer and uh, they were thankful or polite to them is not polite actually thankful yeah. thankful is the right answer thankful they were curious or sad about yeah yes they curious and please not sad curious they opened the dash cardboard or actually that blue and yellow cardboard or wooden box which one is the right answer here we get the answer there was they opened the blue cardboard with blue only banks uh, actually here that mm, there were five small piggy banks the answer is small and next one is there was a dash note to inside actually it's not a long short notes short is the right answer short then then you can it said pinky's piggy bank is see all colors are here pinky's piggy bank is blue color blue color blue again rashi's piggy bank i think yes rashi's piggy bank is green color second one is green next Jens, right? Jens piggy bank is orange color, orange, orange. Then again, Rehan will get the yellow, right? Is there? Yeah, Rehan will get the yellow piggy bank, yellow. And then last one, I think, Simi. Yeah, red piggy bank is no. Mm. Yes, dear students, mm, we have completed these activities, and 
Yeah, next lesson we will learn about the tenses, right? Uh, I'll end up the class here.